Good afternoon, um, Facebookers, Instagrammers, YouTubers, and interwebers in general. Uh, welcome to uh, Shirt Pocket Productions and uh, another installment of the Panhead Project. What you're looking at there are two Panhead frames, the uh, 1950 Hardtail and the uh, 1960 Swing Arm frame. Um, I just picked them both up from the, uh, the strippers. Um, stripping company and uh, the 1950 frame has been uh, stripped of all of its ugly paint and bondo if you remember it was green and it had some bondo in the smoothing you can see the neck uh, that's where it's been raked um, it actually wasn't all filled with bondo it's been actually filled with uh, metal it's actually raked um, from what I understand correctly um, but it's, uh, it's, it's ugly in places um, where it was smoothed and, and manipulated um, there's some ugly looking welds on it, uh, but I think it's okay. I think it's solid, um, and it certainly can be restored back to stock. Uh, and it looks like it's pretty straight. I don't know what I'm going to do with this frame. I, I really don't. Uh, I may build another bike out of it as it is. Um, after I you know, make it pretty again, I may restore it to stock and build a bike out of it that way. I may sell it as is. I may restore it and sell it. No idea. All I know for sure, um, from the hallmarks that are left, because some of them in the process uh, were removed. We can see some of the hallmarks like that one there are very much visible, uh, the ones on the neck or not, um, um, are, uh, are genuine. This is a 1950 frame, an early 1950 frame. And uh, no question about that. Uh, just a lot of it's been manipulated. Certainly not unmolested, but it's a good frame. It's desirable and it's worth, I don't know, easily a thousand dollars as it sits, maybe more. Uh, fully restored, probably 2500 and it's only going to go up. Over here, we have the, uh, the one I acquired in that roller. Um, this is a pretty good um, 1960 frame, uh, and you can see the hallmarks on it are really clear now, um, all over it, and uh, almost everything's there. Uh, there's a couple things about it, but, uh, like I said before, the the top tank mount has been, the top one mount has been cut off and this one's welded on, uh, not terribly. Um, the, uh, other, some other things have been removed and uh, this exhaust hanger mount has been kind of booger welded on and it looks like something was cut off there. Not sure what all is going on there. I'll have to compare it with the book. Um, the threads for the swing arm are uh, stripped out, I'll have to have an insert put in there of some kind. Um, but it's in really good shape. Um, what you're seeing here is raw metal. Uh, there's no primer or anything on there that's just stripped down to raw metal. And um, I have to get the gloves to manipulate it with. I want to touch it as little as possible because it will rest almost instantly. Although, you know, in this climate where very little humidity here is probably not terrible, but um, it's, uh, it's in really good shape. Uh, anyway, I'm going to take this down to Cork and uh, we're going to look it over and see what we need to do and see what uh, what's going to happen. And then it's going to go back to the strippers where they're going to powder coat it. Um, and we're going to go with white, I believe. Still got the keyhole in this one. And um, it looks pretty good. This one looks pretty good. And, um, and that's where we're at. So they're going to go onto this moving blanket here uh, for the time being. Um, you know, the lift over there is empty right now. I've got my bike over here. And uh, next thing going to the strippers are these tins. Uh, don't know, you know, whether or what I'm going to use yet. I just know I'm using that fender. Um, I've got this other fender that came with the hardtail. I've got that, I don't know if you can see it back there. There's a peanut tank back there hanging on the walls in that green. Um, I won't be using for this project for sure. Um, but uh, it's uh, more progress, more progress. Excited. Uh, anyway, until next time. Yeah, this is Peace.